This video is somewhat of a companion piece to my earlier video on swing weight, which you can find here or down in the video description below. Before we dive a little bit deeper into twist weight, let's quickly go over static weight and swing weight just to refresh our memories. Static weight is a traditional weighing method that measures the weight of a paddle while it is at rest without any movement. Swing weight essentially is how heavy a paddle feels when swinging it. Twist weight, like swing weight, is a dynamic measurement, meaning it requires movement to measure. What does twist weight measure exactly? It measures the paddle's resistance to twisting along its length. Twist weight, which is synonymous with torsional stability, essentially quantifies how a pickleball paddle resists rotation when striking a ball off center. Paddles with a higher twist weight exhibit minimal rotation similar to a sweet spot hit, while those with lower values are more responsive to off-center impacts, affecting overall paddle stability. This will make the paddle feel less forgiving. So basically, if you hit a ball near the edge of the face of the paddle, some of the energy is not transferred into your shot, but goes into the twisting of the paddle in your hand. Paddles with higher twist weights rotate less in the hand on contact and better transfers energy back into your shot. How this will feel to the user is usually described as having a larger and more forgiving sweet spot. This is typically why wider, more standard shape paddles tend to have better twist weights. The additional mass found in the paddle face near the edges contribute to higher twist weight and therefore adds to torsional stability of the paddle when compared to their elongated counterparts. You can increase twist weight by adding lead or tungsten tape to the edges of your paddle. Just note that when adding weight, you may also decrease the speed and maneuverability of your paddle. So it's important to find the right balance for your playing style. If you want to see or learn more about how and where to add weight to your paddle, you can check the link in the video description below. All right, that's it for this video. Catch you guys on the courts.